All right, 1684 to date, the largest sack of the day, 1932. They've got a better sack today, 1851, a two-day total, 33 even. New leaders! Weigh in for the 2020 Boat U.S. Collegiate Bass Fishing Championship presented by Bass Pro Shops is well underway and Pickwick Lake is flexing its muscle early. Numerous bags over the 15 pound mark have been brought in thus far. Traditionally, it takes a two day total of 40 plus pounds to win this event. Someone will need to set the bar at 35 pounds or higher to put some heat on the remaining top teams. All right, Campbellsville University, Dalton and Bradley, they had a really good day yesterday. They had 14-42, and my goodness, that's another good-looking sack. This may be the biggest sack of the day, and it is 2021. The first 20-pound sack. Set them out on the carpet. Get out those biggest fish. That is the largest sack of the tournament so far. Dalton Smith and Bradley Dunnigan from Campbellsville University set the bar to reach at 34.6 pounds following a 20 plus pound showing here on the final day. I was super happy with how the day turned out. I mean, it, at, at 12 o'clock we had, I don't know, 10 pounds and, and stuff just started clicking and we both caught fish and we both helped out. It's been a great teamwork this week. We've had probably one of the most fish catching trips I've ever been on. Uh, we've, we've probably caught over 80 fish, so it's been awesome. The final few flights continue to roll into McFarland Park, but no one team has come close to threatening the boys from Campbellsville for that top spot. That could all be about to change as the hometown team of Martin McCravey and Tristan Crowder from UNA make their way to the stage. The second 20-pound sack. We're going to get some pictures. 21-03. The second 20-pound-plus bag of fish. Dunnigan and Smith are able to maintain their spot in the angle cooler's hot seat as they edge out UNA by less than a pound. Only three teams remain to weigh in, and it's time to do some numbers crunching as we prepare to crown a national champion. Have you done any math to what weight they needed from yesterday to catch you? Uh, I mean, I know what it is, but I, I think, I don't know the leader, I, 19, so I guess he needs about 15 pounds. University of Montebello, James and Chase, they only need 1631. They had 18 yesterday. You dodged another bullet. 1063, guys. Awesome. You've got 2896. Now, Dallas Baptist coming up next. They only need 1556. And they had 19 pounds yesterday. Uh-huh. Whoa. He's using two hands. Look over at them, see. They need 16, or they need 15, 56. So close. 14, 58. So it's still, it's not over, over yet? No, no, never over here. You ready? Uh, might as well be. All right, lay them up there. All right, Bailey and Preston, y'all led this thing yesterday. You, they only need 14 and change. I was wrong. They had 1982, and they have 16, 17. Brown College just won it. Yes, sir. Bailey Fane and Preston Kendrick from Bryan College bring in a five bass limit of 16.17 pounds to claim first place with a two day total of 35.99 pounds. Their plan to work the same area for two full days pays off in a big way as they are crowned national champions. We're at a loss of words. I mean, right now, I mean, it was, uh, we started off the morning just like we did yesterday on our, uh, we had a spot yesterday they were schooling on and we pulled up to it this morning and, and we caught most of the weight uh, on the schooling hole. And then uh, we upgraded one more time uh, flipping. None of us thought we would even be in this position. It was just the good Lord. I, I just want to thank God for even giving us this opportunity. I mean, I'm just very grateful. And here's a look at how the top 10 shook out following the conclusion of weigh-in. Fane and Kendrick sit there at the top and will take home several thousands of dollars in prizes and contingencies. Mixed in there amongst the top 10, you'll notice several teams representing schools in contention for the Bass Pro Shop School of the Year presented by Abu Garcia.